have you started? We measure our voltage in parallel, right? So what we are going to do is we, we, we follow our schematic here. It says from the positive of the supply, it goes to positive of R1. Um, in, in this case, I'm going to connect component by component. So from the negative, from the negative of the supply, it goes to negative of R1. From the positive of R1, it goes to positive of R2. From the negative of R1, it goes to negative of R2. Now, from the positive of R2, it goes to positive of R3. And from the negative of R3, it goes to negative. Uh -uh. From the negative of R2, it goes to negative of r3 so by now guys you know if you actually take these two probes and you plug them directly on the multimeter you should be getting your total resistance here of 5.0 so in, in in this case we're not worried about the total resistance we're worried about measuring the total voltage so what we are going to do there is we're going to grab two extra probes for the voltage measurement the positive of the multimeter is uh, your V sign here and the negative is always the common terminal so now if we want to measure the total voltage the positive of the multimeter goes to positive of the supply the negative of the multimeter goes to negative of the supply and we switch to the volt scale um, I'm just going to change this to it's still 12 volts now it's still 12 volts so there um i'm gonna switch this meter quickly so here it gives us a total voltage of 11.91 now um to measure the voltage across resistor one the positive of the meter goes to positive of r1 the negative of the meter goes to negative of r1 so we measure the 11.84 for our voltage across r2 the same thing the positive of the meter goes to positive of r2 negative of the meter goes to negative of r2 then we measure here we measure 11.7 and you apply the same concept to vr3 Positive of the meter goes to positive of R3 and the negative goes to negative of R3. And we measure what there? We measure, uh, we measure uh, VR3. But in this case, VR3 negative. Why is it showing VR3 negative? Because the negative of the meter, you see we swap the terminals. This gives us what? Negative VR3. And, and that's it, guys.